Okay, hi everybody. Um, it's Friday again, uh, September 6th, and today I was going to only eat for four hour window, but it didn't work. So <laughs> I went to the grocery store in a fasted state. I was going to spend $40, and I ended up spending 100 so, a little out of control. I'm in day 12 of my, you know, nine pounds out day 12. And, yeah. Okay, so I'm hungry today. So, I came home and I'm doing an 816 today, getting some sanity with it. And I had some stock to break my fast. And I ate some of my um, oatmeal steel cut oatmeal to kind of cool this uh, now craving because I just put myself in my food place. <laughs> anyway, but I did find something very interesting. I went to Wild Fork um, and picked up a bunch of meat. And the thing that I'm very, that I'm excited, it was one of the reasons that I blew it. I would have only blown it at Trader Joe's by $10, but Wild Fork because I'm kind of doing a keto, not really doing keto. I'm not doing keto, but I'm doing um, good grass-fed, sustainably uh, produced, trying to do sustainably produce as much as possible, um, good meat um, for the dieting. So I know my husband really likes meat. I'm not huge on it. So, um, but I'm going to try to do really good quality instead of quantity. I've always kind of done that, but I'm kicking it up a few notches on it. And what I found there, because, I'm, because I am doing, in my intermittent fasting, I am doing bone broth when I break fast. And that's because of Thomas DeLauer. Um... I hope I say his name like that. If not, you'll have to get in Delauer, right? Uh, free YouTube videos. It's awesome. You get like your own like private coach. I have to tell you, you know, you can find pretty much most what you want to do there. So I use Thomas Delauer. He is a keto in an intermittent minute fasting. And then I also love, um, Six Miles to Supper, Cox. Her last name's Cox. I forgot her first name. I can't remember. Um, she's kind of inspired. I, I, and for me, I kind of want to mix in between both of them. So because I'm not going to do a total keto diet, my husband might at some point. But right now, I'm just trying out the fasting. And the reason that I'm trying out the fasting is because I know it worked for myself before... Um, I was down to 147. I didn't know it was called intermittent fasting. I just did it naturally. So anyway, okay, so I went to Wild Fork, Wild Fork, uh, which is a pretty cool uh, store and it has a lot of interesting meat, I would say. Um, I was able to get a duck breast for five dollars. I mean, I, I got a frozen duck breast. And I really like Duck. It's a really good meat. Um, yeah. Where did I go? Oh. Okay. Uh, I'm going to get a duck breast right here. Boneless duck breast. And when I make it, I, uh, I'll show everybody how to make this. This is the easiest thing in the world. Take my cast iron, put it in. Flip it and eat it. This this is a this is a time saver, easy. And these were like six dollars, I think five ninety eight. So six dollars, which is a really good deal for them. So, okay, and what else did I pick up? I oh, this was interesting too. This is grass fed beef, but it's like in these. You know how the ground comes out in these little kind of weird things? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. So the nice thing about them is that they're individually frozen. So you can like pour out 
as much as you need. I'm like, it's 100% grass-fed ground beef here. So you won't have any, never any grain or animal byproducts. Um, it does not say organic. Uh-oh. But, okay. Maybe I'll call them and see if they're all right. Let me see. Okay. So anyway, okay, so I was able to get that and and I got 100% organic grass-fed meat. This one was $5, $5.80. I got a chunk of that. I use this for tacos, spaghetti, whatever, you know, and that's frozen. All these meats at Wild Fork come frozen. So, but the real interesting thing that I got was these bone-in split marrow bones and something else too. And what I'm gonna do with this, because I'm doing bone broth, I'm gonna make my own bro broth. Because this bag was $5, and I spent probably $20 last week on bone broth. I bought a really nice one from Whole Foods. It was $8, it came in a beautiful glass jar, you know? I wonder if I kept that beautiful glass jar. I think I recycled it. And I could have used that beautiful glass jar. Darn it. 